Here we go then, first job. Remove the seat. And these covers. That's the wrong one. Although these are, uh, they are loosened off because I had my saddlebags on. But I'll just show you quickly on this bit. Cover off. And let me just show you here. This is the piece that holds the mug guard on. And if I can show you, this is where this bracket has to be cut off. Angle grinder. Uh, precipitating saw, whichever one, and then all that back mug guard is off. This is the cable for it, uh, lights, indicators, everything, and that's just the seat release. So, next bit, we'll undo these. And I'll do the same on the other side. Right, this is just a note to myself really. Um, I did replace the rear indicators and I'm going to remove the cover just to check what the original wires were and see what they do. These were the original indicators. And I changed them to this smaller type so we'll just take that cover off and trace the wires back right so I've got the covers off and the right indicator onto the original wires is grey with black yellow stripe right indicator left indicator green yellow black stripe red blue with yellow black is the tail light and the red yellow black is the number play light right that's all the mounting bolts out of the rear mudguard fender 
and it's dropped down to the floor. So I've just got the bracket for the seats and the cable and then we can take that off. Okay on to the next bit and this is definitely no turning back. Um, this bit has to be cut off. That's the bit that used to hold the old mug guard on. So we've got to cut it across there which you can see the line I've already done that so on to the next side and let's get this removed. There we go, the noise a bit done, the brackets are off, so we can pick you up, sorry about that, and show you what we do, so that's them bits off, out of the road, so that we can progress onto the next stage. <laughs> 